Beautiful, I hope. Welcome everybody to 360. As you can see, we have a all-star all -star cast of many people here from all over the place, um, which is pretty cool. Ash will be on, is planning on being on uh, soon. But in the meantime, uh, I'll get started. Um, as you know, what we've heard from uh, Mr. Mufar a couple months ago, starting that uh, he's taken charge <laughs> and he's going to redirect back where he wants it to be. It got a little off course, it looks like, and uh, he's taken charge. And the beauty of it, what has been said for two or three weeks in a row is when it's finished, and we, and we come back with a vengeance and things will be as we as we get started back up it's going to be unbelievable and i can't wait uh i know everybody has the faith and the trust in what's going on and that's what we keep doing nothing's changed and i'm really happy to be part of this There's five and a half years i wouldn't want to be anywhere else uh, i trust the process i obviously trust mr mufara and everybody here we became one big family and i think that's priceless. And uh, like I said, I'll turn it over. Let me turn it over to Red and we'll get moving. Thanks very much, Marty. Good to be here by amongst very esteemed guests. Nice to see everybody. Uh, as I did last week, no um, recap, obviously, whilst uh, we're part of this migration and uh, the restructuring of OnPassive as we see it at the moment. Uh, until things are back up, I won't be doing a recap. But the good news is, guys, that things are moving along. We've heard from our CEO uh, on multiple occasions. He's turning up uh, on a weekly basis at the moment, which is absolutely fantastic for all of us. Certainly gives us the encouragement that knowing that we have our the very best captain at our helm steering us in the right direction. What you're seeing at the moment is really is part and parcel of uh, business. Uh, there's no uh, nothing to be worried about as far as uh, things that you might be hearing or seeing at the moment. This is all in hand and we have the best person uh, at the helm to take us through some little stormy waters that we might have at the moment. It's natural in business, guys, that no business ever, ever gets a free ride to the top. There is always going to be bumps along that road. On passive is no difference. But one thing is assured, and that is you're going to absolutely love the end result. That is for sure. It's going to blow your socks off when we get going again. Mark my words. As I put my name to it, as Ash Mufara puts his name to it, Red Redfern says you have not seen anything else, anything yet than what we are going to be doing in on passive. So stick with us, guys. OK, I know things are a little bit turbulent at the moment, but we have the best family around us. We have the best team that we could possibly want to get us through this sticky patch at the moment. And with the man at the front, all is good. Back to you, Marty. I was checking YouTube. Uh, uh, who else would like to make a comment? Anyone? Don't all raise your hand at the same I, time. I, I would. I, okay, can I? They, here, yeah, no, of course I you are can. we doing boy, girl, boy, girl? Uh, sure. Yeah, and some, <laughs> somewhere along the line, we're going to have to throw Chris in. But anyway, go ahead. Yeah. Oh, someone put my hand up for me. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, Ash. Hi, everybody. So this is, this is, I'm going to make it short and sweet. I know, love, and trust Ash Mufara and on passive. And that's all I need to know. And our captain is running this ship. And I believe in the vision. Um, and we're going to get there. And we're all going to be smiling. So let's continue to enjoy this journey, even though it's a little bumpy right now, I know, love, and trust Ash Mufara and on passive, and he's gonna he's gonna get us to where we're going. Love you, Ash. Love everyone here. Keep the faith. 
I, I guess I can say something. Uh, who is this Ash Mafara guy anyway? Uh, famous line I said years ago. Um, I would like to personally tell you that I've met a lot of people in my life. Um, I've met CEOs. I've met a president of the United States. I've met a lot of people. Uh, I have to say this from my heart, Ash Mafara. He's got 100% of my trust. I believe in what he's doing because it's the right thing to do. Uh, plain and simple. Um, I've never seen any company in my life that wants to help out humanity, help out the world, uh, not push one race to a side or put another race to the side. He wants everyone together. And uh, that's why I believe in Ash Mafar and this company so much. So Ash Mafar from the Johnson family, we give you 100% of support, trust, and faith in you. And uh, boy, we're, we're just going to take this and people are just going to be in shock and awe. I really believe that. Thanks, brother. Testing, testing. Oh, go ahead. Sorry about that. Whoever wants to go. Oh, are Colin, you going, Mike? Go ahead, Michael. Oh, okay. I thought Mike was going. Um, yeah, hello, everyone. Uh, you know, I just reflect um, back to, you know, why I got involved in On Passive. Uh, and I think all of us can do the same, you know, uh, and uh, as we look to see that we got in because some of us had dreams, uh, some of us had you know, various goals, aspirations, you know, all of that. And the question is, you know, are those still alive, right? Are we still going to accomplish those things? And for me, it's a resounding yes, absolutely. There's no doubt whatsoever that that is the case. And that's all that matters to me. Right? At the end of the day, will I be able to accomplish my goals that I came into on passive for? Right? Are the right people involved in on passive to make that happen? And I remember listening to uh, you know, those two audio tapes uh, from our CEO, Mr. Ash Mafara, and that's all I needed, right? And you know, as time went on, you know, we saw so much and we we you know got to know him a lot better and to understand the type of person that he is. And here is someone that has gone in the line of fire to say that we're going to do this or die. We're going to make this happen. We're going to uplift humanity. We are going to make sure that people uh, can actually dream again and not just dream again, but actually accomplish those dreams. Right. We look around us in society right now and we see chaos, whether it's in the U.S., whether it's in you know, Africa, Europe, it doesn't matter where you look in the world. All we see is chaos. We see the economy uh, falling apart. We see people struggling financially, right? And we say, where is the solution? Can we turn to our government for help? The answer is no, right? <laughs> can, we, can we turn to um, you know, the banks for help? And the answer is no, right? Your employer, can you go to your employer and say, listen, I'm in a financial rut. Can you help me out here? Right. People are working two jobs, three jobs. Right. People are going online looking for ways out. Right. And they're meeting so many obstacles because not everyone is sincere about helping you. And the reality is most of us, if not all of us, actually need some sort of help. And where do I find that help? Where do I find that hope? I find that in on passive because it's the only company that I see that is willing to do what it takes to make sure that not just the company is helped, but that everyone who choose to come in, everyone who choose to be a part of this great company, right, actually have a real chance, a realistic chance of making their dreams come true. And that's what this is about. So for me, I will forever be with on passive. I will forever, you know, lock arms with our CEO because he's a man of integrity. This is someone that means you good, right? He's not here to hurt you. We're not here to hurt you. This company's not here to hurt you. That's not what on passive is about. And if we look at what has transpired from day one, from when you got in until now, you can see that for yourself. No one has to remind you about it. You can take a look and see exactly what your participation has been and where you are right now, right? And to see, okay, does it make sense that my dream is still alive? Can I go somewhere else and accomplish my dream? Is that possible, right? What are my choices? What are my options? Right. And all I see is on passive. Why? Because it's a company still built with heart. No matter how you dice it, slice it, that's exactly what we see. 
And that's exactly what is happening here. So yes, company has to, you know, sort out whatever challenges, issues, you know, get the migration taken care of, uh, whatever restructure that needs to be uh, in place, whatever it takes to make sure that we will be all right. And that's the bottom line, folks. So I'm sure there's many of you out there, hundreds of thousands of you out there that feel the same way like I do, and that yes, this is where I lay my hat, but this is where I can sleep good at night because I know that there's a man that's in charge that is willing to do what it takes, a man that's in charge that's willing to do it or die. Folks, you can't find that anywhere else. Your president, your prime minister, they're not gonna do that for you. Your employer is not going to do that for you. You got family members that will not do that for you. But here's a man who's a stranger to most of us, and yet he's willing to do that for you. So that's why I stand with them and I lock arms with them because together, together, we're going to make your dreams, my dreams, all of our dreams a reality. Fantastic. Absolutely. Thank you, Michael. I'm going to go to Mike Ellis in one minute. I just want to add a little bit, you know. 25 years, I looked for a company that was fair, took care of people. Everybody got the same pitch. Everybody's on the same team. Uh, and there, there's no advantages or disadvantages. And, and about five and a half years ago, I came across this company, and it was bigger and better than I ever could have dreamed of. I have never woke up in the morning and thought ever, thought, well, I wonder if it's going to be okay. Never. I, I don't think about it. It doesn't even cross my mind. And that's a great feeling. That's a great feeling. And I'm telling you, and, and this is not bragging. I can bring in, I have gone to thousands of people, targeted traffic, and I failed. Why did I fail? Because the company and the person running the company was designed against people. And I, you can't, you cannot duplicate what you do no matter what anybody tells you. Ash made it duplicatable for everybody that's in, they win. And, and, and I've never thought different. I won't think different. And it's the only company that every month I felt better and stronger than I did the month before. Most companies I got in and within 30 days, I'm looking to, I would turn on the, the computer real slow to see if the, see if the company's still alive. No joke. Mike knows that's why he's laughing. But that's the way it was. I found a home. This is my family. And another thing that I've never seen is this many people, good-hearted, that were drawn together by heart, not by eyesight only. And that's pretty powerful. Okay, I'm going to thank you, Michael Williams. You got me burned up. So <laughs> anyway, uh, I'll turn it over to Mike Ellis. Yeah, no, no, thanks, Marty. Um, th th this is a good time to have a meeting like this. Uh, you know, over the last few weeks, three weeks, four weeks, it's really been interesting times. And, you know, everybody wants to know where we are, how we're doing, and how things are going to turn out. And, and I want to start by, by just telling everybody, on passive is golden, period. When we think about the last three or four weeks, Mr. Mavar has come on. And he has talked to us and he's brought clarity to the situation. And he's talked about having to do a few things within on passive to get on passive exactly where he wants it to be. And then things are going to flow. It, it really is that simple. And that clarity is, is just absolutely terrific. You know, when we talk about interesting days, anytime Mr. Mufara comes on, it's just not an inter interesting day. It's a really, really good day. And the good days are here. They really are. If you just listen and then and then have a little patience, Mr. Before is going to do what he has to do. And from there, everything is going to flow and it's going to be it's going to be perfect in, in my mind. Unpassive is going to be better than we ever thought it would be. And, and as I start to think about unpassive, I know all the things that are going to be happening. And we've talked about them for for a long time now. Nothing has changed. Mr. Mufar has you at heart, and he wants to bring something that will benefit you and change your life. But I, I think I think as I look at, and I've been on Unpass like Marty and Dan, I've been on for, for five and a half years. And when I think about Unpassive, I think the one thing that Mr. Mufar is bringing to the table that is so rare, and it's really not part of the human nature, it's not part of the human psyche, 
is he's bringing he's bringing dignity to the floor. And, and really, when you think about that, he's giving people a chance and the ability to feel that dignity that's within them, not only within them, but but actually is a reality. You, you have the reality of, of, of being respected, being honored, and you don't find that in many places. And I think on passive, when you start to think about, I, I don't worry about what's coming. It's coming. It's not a worry. We are in great shape. We are golden. But the things Mr. Mufar brings to individuals, bringing back that dignity of people so that they actually feel honored and respected, that is a rare, rare thing. Right now, everybody out there, just hold on a little bit. Let Mr. Mufar do the things he's going to be doing and has to do. And when he's done, he's going to come out and he's going to tell you exactly where we are, exactly what time we are within on passive. And we're very, very close, guys. But the dignity that he gives people, it, it's such a rare thing. Uh, I, I think you need to hold on to that. Understand that you're in a place that uh, the air really is rare. You just do not find that in society that often. And, and Michael Williams said it so well. Nobody else is going to give you this. You can go through a litany of individuals that are in your life in one way or another. Nobody's going to bring to the table what on passive is going to bring to the table and literally, in time, on passive, it is going to change your life. It's going to change your life for the better. And that dignity, that respect, that honor, it's going to come in and you're going to feel it. And, and Marty shares that every day with people, with uh, with his lives, when he brings people in and puts a spotlight on. You don't find that very many places. On passive, in my mind, is the only place where that is the goal, to give people the respect that they deserve. Marty, go ahead and take it from there. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mike. Uh... Engineer Mike, I think you're next, man. Your hands are up. Yes, Marty. Good day, everybody. Hello, Ash. Good day, good day. This, um, this past days have been very exciting for me. When I listened to when our CEO came out here and he reassured us that Opasif is here to stay. Opasif is not going nowhere. I, it pumps my blood, my adrenaline went very high when he told us that humanitarian help is coming. Can you imagine? I took myself now right to when every other company, every other business, what they do is they go to start looking to uh, about their corporate social responsibilities is when they have started making profit. But our CEO on his own is different. We remember when the humanitarian crisis came up, Syria and and uh, and um, Turkey, one million dirham, just like that, and equipments and all of that. We saw what he did with Obles launching on the 30th of uh, of March in 2022. All of that. So I I just I just keep myself um, being pumped up with the projects that all of us here have. So that is my thing. I'm just dreaming and waiting for our own passive ecosystem to come back so that we continue our journey. But thank you, Mr. Mufara, for sharing your business with us. We are with you, brother. Thank you. Fantastic, Mike. Uh, Mr. Collins Mana. Thank you, um, uh, Digamo. Just want to greet everyone on the panel. And uh, thank uh, reading to Mr. Ash Mofara. You know, last for the couple of weeks, I've been talking about patience, hope, trust, and belief. You know, these four things. If you don't have it, then you don't have to be in any business. The first thing you must believe. Why you join on passive? Why do you join any business? It's part of the believing. Because if you don't have any belief, there is nothing to do. Why do you join something with the hope that you will fail? You can go to an exam with the hope that you will fail. Then you have just zero. And the next thing is when you join, the, the next thing you have to trust in what they are doing. I trust in the vision of Mr. Ash Mufara. That's why I joined on passive instantly. I know it will not be easy because you can't build technology in one day. It takes time to build something of this magnitude. Like my mom always said, you know, and I quote, he said, never ever wish for life to be easy. 
because life will never get easy. But wish and pray that as long as life gets difficult, you become stronger. That's it. You become stronger in difficulties. That's the only time you can succeed. And I always said, if I am in something and I want to fail, I want to fail with my head forward. I want to fail forward and fail backward. I don't want to fail like a coward. That is why I'm in Unpassive, because I know that my dream in Unpassive is assured. You cannot be a half-big person. You are either in or out. You must be 100% in to understand Unpassive. You cannot be halfway, half-big, and you think you know everything. We don't know everything here, but the little that I know in Unpassive keeps me excited. You know, from day one, I've been excited. My excitement is growing every day as we move along. And that's the only hope I have in Unpassive. As much as I know my CAO is here, I know Unpassive is not going anywhere. The only thing I will always tell like, to founders and affiliates, always be part of this journey because you will never see this again. Be part of the journey because you will never ha have any story to tell. Whatever will happen when people will be celebrating, and people will come to you and tell you, Did you tell me about your story. You have zero story to tell because you were not part of it. The only joy we have in Unpassive now is about the journey. Because whatever will come after is just history. And I'm so blessed and grateful to be part of this journey. We just want to thank Ash and thank everybody here. Thank you. Fantastic call. Hey, Marty. If you uh, want me to jump in, go ahead. My, let me one second, Mr. Ash. Sure, brother. Uh, some of you, do, I apologize. Some of you don't have hands to rave, so we're just going to pick you all. So just uh -huh. uh, the ones with the hands that are up will go first, and then we'll start picking you. How about two? There you go. Well, you're all right. Brother. I'm going to jump in. Okay. I'm going to be rude and, and, and intrusive, whatever you like. Okay. Uh, I really uh, like what uh, Colin said, and uh, I, I love that attitude. Got to be brave and... Uh, uh, we also know that the tougher the battle, the sweeter the victory. Uh, it's no secret that we have been going through some turbulence, as uh, uh, Red uh, stated rightfully, and it has been a bit, you know, bitter for a while. And we thought the worst times and the biggest challenges are behind us. A while ago, we were wrong, and we got even more. Uh, challenges, okay? But the more tense and the more aggressive those challenges get, uh, we understand the power and the value and, of course, the worthwhile of what we have. Uh, incredible, incredible to see how much resistance we have um, for something supposed to be good news for humanity. And we realize the value of financial freedom. We realize the value of money. It's evil. It, it, the whole fight is about that. Uh, greed is there. Uh, you know, bad things happen to good people. It's no secret. We've been a victim. Uh, we have been uh, probably attacked. Uh, I think we've mentioned that to you. Uh, some by design, some it is what it is. Regardless of all of that, th that doesn't matter because I always said, and I often say that uh, someone's opinion of you doesn't have to become a reality. And somebody's attitude towards your success, you're going to make it, you're not going to make it, or we're going to like, you know, uh, trip you on the way. It doesn't have to decrease your passion and your drive. The more resistance you have, the more aggressive you should get and the more you should value the target and the goal that you're chasing. If nobody's looking at it, it 
have <laughs> it's it's kind of like worthless okay so nobody cares it's like not a big deal but if everybody's going after what you're building you're up to something big i don't know about you sometimes we walk into a restaurant right from the door i have to talk about uh, food chris okay you're at the door and we see nobody there like things are sitting there food is like okay okay we just turn our <laughs> we go back nobody here and next door big line we don't know how it is but people loving it so we just go that's exactly what's happening a lot of people are lining up for what we have or attacking they're you know invading from the back door from the good door no matter how uh they're they're trying to get a slice of what we have uh it all doesn't matter. What matter is our attitude and the truth will always emerge. The truth will always come out. If you're doing business with God, it's always a success. You're going to always make it, make a massive profit. You're going to go to the bank if you're doing the right thing with Almighty God. Okay, that's it. Now, um, do we have what it takes to get through this? Give me more. All right? It's boring. I like the heat. And I'm more excited when there's challenges. Now we're talking. Everything is very obvious as the sun. Uh, we're going to have some uh, entertaining surprises for you <laughs> in the coming days. Uh, we will ask you to bring popcorn, some good drama, but that's all irrelevant. What matters the most is we're going to go places. We're going to go beautiful destinations, uh, and uh, we got what it takes. We're able, we've done it before, we're doing it now, much stronger, much better, more secure, and uh, we have more love on board. Okay? Uh, the uh, tough times reveal the true character. You're not going to build the character in the tough times. Reveal the true, now we know the true character of so many of us. And here we are. Luckily, Unfortunately, we are made of gold. I'm talking about us collectively here. We're made of gold. We have the right stuff within. And we're not just going to get through this. We're going to have the best, uh, uh, you know, comeback and turnaround that is really, truly going to make history. Mark my word, we're going to make history. And, uh, you know, I wish we were able to dive into the, de the details, but all irrelevant at the moment your dream not only there okay and intact protected but in fact if you allow me to say this it just got better and the stock value for what we have just got way higher for that i think we're some uh, fun in the coming days and, and weeks gonna be productive entertaining at the same time uh, I appreciate you. I appreciate all the nice, kind, and beautiful and wise things that you just said ahead of me. I just want to open way for uh, more, uh, you know, good uh, brothers and sisters to talk here and anyone else uh, so we can uh, think of the next event. I agree with you, Mike Ellis. This uh, this was really a good uh, gathering. It's, uh, it's been a while, and I love... Uh, the original. <laughs> okay, thank you. Back to you, Mr. DeGarmo. I love you. Well, I think I'm going to change your name to Rocky Balboa. Um, <laughs> anyway, let me move on to uh, uh, Vincent. Vincent 2.0. You know what I'm talking about, Vincent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, uh, thank you, Marty. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> thank you very much for that. Yeah. So, yeah. And thank you, uh, Mr. Ash. Hello, everyone, for those who are listening to Ash. So I know a recent, one of the recent Robina, Mr. Ash came and then he said, on passive is here to stay. 
So that statement struck me. So, and then it's right to say on passive is here to stay because a lot of people, they are sitting there outside there. They don't know what Mr. Ash is doing. Mr. Ash is doing a great job. Starting from the four pillars, Mr. Ash built a data center. We have a data center. That is a fact. It's a physical thing that we all know that on passive have a, a data center. And most of the best and the recent and the latest technology data center built with uh, artificial intelligence system. How many great companies outside they have uh, on passive have already? So for me, it's right to say on passive is here to stay. We have also um, uh, on passive ecosystem. We have ecosystem, part of ecosystem. We know, we know, uh, we all have used Oconet. Oconet, we have seen it. So it's also one reason for Mr. Ash to say that on passive is here to stay because we know Oconet, we have used it. And one of the best tools I've used it for webinar and web conferences. So it's the best. So you can have all this and then say uh, on passive is, is, is no good company or on passive something else. No, it's here to stay because on passive, we sure we have it and then we have seen it. I've used it many times. And then most people also on passive here, they have used the product as well. So it's something good. On passive, we have also payment processor. Recently, Mr. Ash showed to us that the payment processor is also out there. One of the great staff to show again that on passive is here to stay. We have the product, the product is there. We can see the product. So one of one of the great thing again, artificial intelligence is also there. How many people know about artificial intelligence? Only few companies are using artificial intelligence, but on passive, using artificial intelligence. Most of our product, they are embedded with artificial intelligence. From our data center to our OES product, they are all embedded with artificial intelligence system. So today, with the cyber security, human being, we cannot, we cannot fight with the cyber security, the, the, the cyber attack, we cannot. So the artificial intelligence, that's the tool we're going to help us fight with that. And then Mr. Ash has prepared for this, something that in the next five years, but the man have done that for that. Now, Mr. Ash, thank you again for that because this is one of the greatest tools. Nowadays, all company, government, countries in the world, company, big company, we all talking about artificial intelligence. But Mr. Ash, with a great vision, have done that for us. And then on passive is part of uh, artificial intelligence job that they are doing. And then part of this century, we're talking about artificial intelligence. One thing I will say again, and then I will last day, we all know at, uh, on passive, we have different offices. We have office in the United States. We have office in Dubai, Bangladesh, India, Adirabad. So again, Dubai. So it tell us that on passive is real. So that's the reason why Mr. I said on passive is here to stay. So those of us who are sitting there and then they are not sure, again, I'm coming today again, to tell you that on passive is real, on passive exists, and then it's going to happen. Like uh, 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 Mr. Uh, 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 Mark Ellis said earlier, something is going to change our life. Michael Michael also said that we have to show our passive. Our passive is going to show our life. It's going to impact our life, and then it's going to impact, impact also our family and friends. Everyone across the world is going to change our life. Red, Mr. Ref also said the same thing. So we have to follow these great people uh, to sh to listen to them. 360, they are always here to motivate us, to show us the direction to follow up. So for again, I'll leave it there to say, Mr. Ash, thank you to say this statement on passive is here to stay. For those of us who doesn't understand, that's one of the reasons why he said on passive is here to stay because he got enough evidence to say on passive is here to stay. Thank you, Marty. So Chris, okay. when you said uh, you had, uh, you've been with American president, did you mean it was uh, Vincent or somebody else? Which yeah. president? It was actually Ronald Reagan, but yeah, Vincent would have worked too. <laughs> <laughs> I thought President DiGarmo, look at the name, man. He's my fancy. VP. I love fancy. Marty, back to you. Hurry up. <laughs> yeah. 
Okay. Um, Mufara, that doesn't make a janitor title. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what an ugly name. All right. Uh, I'm losing my train of thought here. Hold on. Of course you a... should. Yeah. All okay. right, let's well, go back to business. This was amazing. If you're done, uh, I uh, appreciate your time. We we can do this again if you liked it. We have nothing uh, there, but... There, to, there's to three hands up, Ash. Do you want to go to the three and that's it? Oh, I, I'm, of course. Okay. I'm interested. Yeah, definitely. Okay. There we go. All right. Um, I thought they're done. I apologize if you... No, no that's in your cool. hand, yeah. That's cool. Um, it yes. popped up. Everybody's getting inspired. Uh, so is it President Charles Oliver and uh, we know that uh, Julie came from Vietnam, so we give her the queen title. How about that? Yeah, that's pretty good. And and Chris can be the court jester. Just kidding. Uh, anyway, uh, <laughs> I'm going to turn it over to Gina Liba. Go ahead, Jean. Thanks, Marty. Thank you, Ash. Thank you, oh, Chris and Red, uh, for inviting us here today on 360. Um, I just want to quickly say um, that... Four years ago, almost to the day, as of yesterday, um, I first heard the voice of Ash Mufara, and it totally changed my life. And um, I had the great honor of being part of something that is that why you quit singing? To be... <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. But I'm you, kidding. Go, you go, go. <laughs> <laughs> you planned to create something disruptive, right? Uh, something that of would course. shake up the way things yeah. are. And so when I look at the journey that we've had, you know, if it had been perfectly smooth, just like you said, Ash, you were saying, if you, you know, you don't want it to be perfectly smooth because then it means you're not doing anything disruptive. So all of these challenges and, and the thicker and harder and faster that they come just shows that we are disruptive. We are shaking up the way things are because that's what it takes. That's what's necessary. So if, if we want things to go smoothly, we're just really just trying to stay comfortable, which nothing will change if we do that. So I'm just so excited and thrilled and honored. And uh, I'm like a little kid to be involved in the thing that is going to transform humanity and lift it and lift our brothers and sisters. And Ash, I just, I'm just so excited to be here with you. And you know that we love you and support you from now until forever. And that will never change. And so just let us know how we can help. Let us know what we can do to further this. And we're right there holding your hands. And everyone, just get excited because it's about to get really crazy awesome. So thank you so much. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Uh I have to go to Robin Noble because her hand isn't working and she's been texting me and obviously I didn't see it. Julie so, too. Um, Julie too. Julie too. Julie will be after Robin. Go ahead, Thank Robin. you, Jean. That means a lot. Appreciate you. Thank you, Jean. You're amazing. Thanks, Marty. Ash, wonderful to see you. Wonderful to hear you in such oh, strong your voice. Your voice is amazing. I feel and, it. And everybody is so hyped up with all of this and through the excitement. I'm looking at this from a slightly different perspective. I don't need to explain why I joined on Passive anymore. I've been in now five and a half years. I'm not going anywhere. And my faith, my belief, my trust in you, Ash, in on Passive has never wavered and will never waver. So that being said, I don't dwell on that anymore. But in listening to the world events and how lousy, terrible, sad, evil almost the world is right now, we can all do something individually and together through on passive. And I'm not talking about anything other than our mindset, our words, our behaviors, our actions. On passive is the the umbrella it is the huge globe that we will all be part of the the hemisphere the new planet that is going to be emerging but we individually can do so much and through the individual connections and contacts we can broaden this we can create the tidal waves of positivity love integrity truth and that can flow out the 
the news in the world today, and a lot of it is North America, but this is also global, is that companies are laying off, closing down, and disappearing. And this is not just the nine to five jobs. This is also the MLMs and the other, quote, direct sales and other businesses that are out there. People are losing their jobs right, left, and center. The fear that is raising and rising is tangible. It is real. The governments are falling apart. They don't know what to do. People don't know how to behave with all of this. But can we take a mindset and shift ourselves when we see that things are falling apart or perceiving that they are falling apart? Can we shift to see that things might actually be falling into place? And the same thing can then be applied to unpassive. This is not a delay. This is not a a stop that on passive is, is experiencing. This is something that is actually putting pieces into very secure foundation that's going to be there for all of us for a very, very long time. We have truth and integrity on our side, but how many actually believe this? World events are showing us through governments, elections that are coming up, through business partnerings and, and other activities, that the truth that is really coming out as well is not even being believed. People don't know what the truth is anymore. There's fake news. There's everything that's been over, um, it's been destroyed and distorted. Distorted is the word I was looking for. And that people don't understand and cannot realize what actually stands right in front of them as truth and integrity. Our faith can move mountains and our doubt can create him. What side of this do we stand on? This is individual. This is what we can do as individuals and then uniting through the friendships and, and contacts that we have made through on passive. This is what we can show to the world and this is where we deserve to be part of something so wonderful. Let's show other people through our words and our actions that support Ash and on passive in this manner. We don't have to go out there and make great big signs and great big events and, and carry on in a large way. It's happening. It can happen as subtly and gently and quietly as saying hello, opening the door for somebody and saying thank you. Also, people think that, well, I'm not going to go down that route, but I want you to realize that Dubai is enjoying a huge surge as a convention destination and as a tourism and medical destination this year. Do you realize the number of people that are going through Dubai with other businesses who are being shown on passive and the global exposure that on passive is getting just through this travel destination? Folks, there's nothing quiet and dormant about on passive. If it's not happening the way you think it should be happening, it's time for you and us to shift our mindset. We've said all along that on passive is going to be creating a new business model. We are part of that. So Ash, thank you so much to what you have done, what you are teaching all of us, what your teams are doing to expand and to help all of us. And this is still going to be one of the most incredible companies helping humanity and global assistance in all aspects of the world. Thank you so much for letting me speak. Well, thank you so much, Robin. That was so sweet of you, as usual. You shine and uh, beautiful voice, beautiful energy. I appreciate that. Always powerful. Hey, thank I'm, you in. I'm sorry, Robin. I, I'm going to jump in real quick. Mr. Ash, I know you got a meeting to get going to, but I have a couple ladies uh, Julie, Marcian, I know we have three gentlemen up there, and um, who was the other one? A uh, Gladys. Where are uh, my here? Indian people? Yeah, they're coming. They're coming. Okay. So let's do the three ladies, and then we'll go to uh, Oliver, Charles, and Niraj. Okay, go ahead, Julie. Thank you so much, Marty. Hello, Mr. Ash. Hello, everyone. It's so good Hi, to Julie. see everyone here. Um, you know, uh, I have had an opportunity uh, to work with, alongside with CEOs and, you know, um, pretty kind of up there with people that creating company. And I have to tell you, 
I have never seen a CEO that full of integrity, transparent, and commitment like Mr. Ashmofara. When I joined in on passive at the very beginning, and Milo has gifted that to me, and I thought, you know, uh, where I am in this company, but as the, along the way, connecting with all the early birds uh, the, in on passive, I have seen myself grow so much. On passive has empowered myself to learn more, to continue to push myself further. To be honest with you, I have never had an opportunity or even have the gut to actually stand in front of the stage talking to hundreds of people. I've never had a gut to hold on to a meeting. I can't even complete a sentence correctly. But because of on passive, it gives you, it's giving me that courage. And of course, I pray that if I can be somewhere with a company, with a group of people, that I could passionately do it the rest of my life. And so here I am sitting here with so many people around the world with our CEO, Mr. Ash Mufara. I have full trust and respect to what this man is doing for humanity as a whole. He embraces people. He loves humanity. And whatever he can do to actually lift up humanity, and that's exactly what he's doing. Every single day, I wake up and I said, I wonder if I can actually have a little taste of the steps that these men and women behind the scene doing what they do to actually helping humanity. So with my commitment and my and with the grace of God, I am here and I'm here forever and belong be, beside all of you here who's watching and the people that on the screen, we are connecting together hand in hand and we can get through whatever the challenges is because if there's no challenge, there's no growth, there's no uh, scalability, there's no solidity. You know, we have to stay together and be solid together to put this, to push this to, through together. Like I said, if there's no challenge, there's no growth. There's no challenge, there's no last long period. So we all together, and I committed to be here hand in hand with every single one of us here, the people on the screen and the people that are watching. We're going to get through this, whatever that challenge is. And with the grace of God, we're going to get through this, and no matter what it is. But the best part of this is on passive, help me to have a simple life. And that yes, is all I wish, to have a simple life. And yes, I've gone through so many things, many years, and I cannot find that. I found my home here. So, Mr. Ash Mufara, I love you. And please send a lot of love to your family as well. Thank you, Marty. Thank you so much. Uh, Julie, you're amazing. You're great. Don't ever listen to Chris Johnson. All right? You're incredible. <laughs> Thank you so much. I love you. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going to Marcy Ann, the Unpassive Dancing Queen. There she is. Thank you so much, Mari. Thank you, everyone. Hello, Mr. Ash. Thank you. Thank you. My journey started exactly four years ago. And this is me now. The whole world know me as a dancing queen, and my life has completely changed. What a great journey. I mean, Unpassive if somebody is still doubting what happened to the trust that you come in in the first day with. Four years ago, when we came to this company, it was by the well of mouth before we, because we trusted someone who brought us in. Today, we have already seen so many things that the company have shown us that is gonna change us, the hope that we have for humanity, the hope that we have to go back home and give drinking water or school education to our sister and brother, the hope that we had 
and we did not know how to do. The hope that we had, and we were thinking, how are we going to achieve it? On passive told us, I'm going to do it for you. All what you have to do is to come in, and I will work for you. Mr. Ash Mufara, let me tell you, brother, you have done it, and I am going to tell you I'm enjoying it, and I am doing what I have to do on my own part, telling the people we are fine and it's going to be okay. No matter how long the night is, the journey, the day is going to shine. And we are going to shine and we are going to do exactly what you have promised us for me. That was four years ago that I started learning and understanding and hear about on passive. Now, what an amazing company that I am in. Today, I'm standing here talking in front of the whole world because of Unpassive, that's what I'm doing. My first language is French. I have never knew that I'm going to say a statement in English. Unpassive is letting me doing this. Thank you, Mr. Ash Mufara. That's such a thing that people doesn't understand. It's not about making money right now. It's about, it's about educating us. It's about learning. It's about growing together. It's about knowing people, having friends around the world. We are all over the world. I have so many friends. I have people that I have never knew that I'm going to meet. I'm educating myself. I'm learning. I'm not an online person, but today I'm somebody that I can put myself around the people that I'll be talking and telling people what to do to better their life tomorrow because of Unpassive. Mr. Ash Mufara, I stand with you. On passive, we stand with you. We are going nowhere and do it or die. We are going to die with you. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you, Sister yeah. Marcian, Queen Marcian. Appreciate yeah. it. She claimed it. Nobody can argue yeah, yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, see what happens on passive does to an introvert. Holy cow. Oh, I got one of those too. Hold on. <laughs> Who else? Susie, Chris, Julie. You can use your hands to make one of those. No, I can't figure that out. Hold on. Oh, right. you don't mix the I, finger. Yeah. Okay. I, I, I Be didn't, careful. Be uh, careful. Uh, it's on YouTube. <laughs> oh, red too. Wow. It's on the other continent too. Okay. Hold yeah. On. The, the deaf community is very proud right now because they love these things. Yes. It is cool. It's so cool. See, uh, I don't have a picture of, of myself or my family, okay, but I don't want them to hear, but I have this. Such a beautiful gift from the deaf community. <laughs> yeah, it is. Beautiful. It's amazing. So unique. All righty, we're going to Gladys. Gladys, you're up. Sorry about that. I, none of these people have hands to put up. There's Gladys. There you go. That is. Wow. Thank you so much. And good afternoon, good evening, everyone. Uh, Mr. Ash Mufare, I want you to know that you are a brother globally, and we love you. I know the entire world where affiliates come from, they love you, but I want you to specifically know that Africa loves you. But why bad people are giving me a hard time, Gladys? <laughs> And we I love, love the 8 billion people, too. That's my password, right, Mari? We love you because of your heart. You started on Passive with the vision to uplift humanity. You said that on Passive is here to stay. Yeah. Uh, for those who have been on, I've been on Passive for six years, and the best is yet to come. I have grown, and I have seen many affiliates grow. You dedicated on passive on the first day when you introduced on passive to the world to God. And you said that only God can stop on passive recently. But for anybody who has been there from the beginning, you knows that your words never changed. Everything that you are going through, whether it's internal or external, it's just to refine you like gold. And boy, you have been refined. I love the fact that you say that they are coming after us because of what we have. But you know what I love most is that you are ready. You say, bring it on. And we are proud to have a leader who is ready to go ahead of us, to take the bullets, to take the pain as we sit behind and just sail following you. 
I count myself blessed to be non-passive because you have given us the hope that we have been looking for, the hope to be able to uplift humanity. And I want to reassure you today that I and many affiliates, we are behind you, we support you, we work with you, because we know that because of non-passive, we will be able to do good around the world. Thank you so much. We love you so much. Thank you, thank you. Uh, sister, I wanna say something, please. I, I feel it, I feel it, really, genuinely. I feel the, the uh, passion, the uh, uh, care, the love, the support. And uh, as I said, uh, when God is in your side, not to worry about anything. Not only that, add to it when you have people of your caliber, of the type of people that we have that spoke ahead or just about to talk, uh, Everything is fine. Uh, life is filled with uh, people with good heart, uh, kind, you know, uh, uh, humane uh, feelings, and, and we're fine. That's all we need. With that, we're unstoppable. I, I certainly want you to know that this gives me infinite energy, unlimited. Beautiful. Okay, now the next one is Joyce. And Joyce, I should have picked you a long time ago because your husband is my biggest fan. And I, I didn't treat you very good. But anyway, you're up. Thank Angie, you. you're on deck, Angie. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Marty. Thank you, Chris. Ash, please forgive my husband for that. So I know that you did. Um, oh, hello, no, everyone. I'm a fan too. Hello, Melvin. <laughs> I hope he's good. Yeah. He's good. Thank you so much. I was just thinking, you know, um, Ash, we love you and appreciate you. But when I think of a power company and um, I think of you, Ash, and on passive, because you've endured so many storms, you've weathered everything that's come your way, just the difficult times. I know you've had so many ups and downs and but you were able to get through every situation. So I love and appreciate you for that. And I know that you've been on mountains and peaks so high that you never wanted them to end but yet you've been to Valley so low that you wanted them to end. And, but you continue to persevere. You continue to go through and you continue to stay in the game. And that is just so uplifting and important. Um, you continue to hold on to do or die. And I know that you and I'm passive are here to stay. One thing I want you to know is that we believe and we trust and we stand with you 100%. We believe that the best is yet to come. And we believe that God has ordained this company caught on passive and he put you at the well to bring it forth. We believe what God has in motion, what he has set in motion, he will see it through. We are so excited, Ash, and of what's to come. Just want you to know that we love you and we continue to stand with you 100%. We are not going anywhere. We are here to stay. We are so in it to win it. Thank you so much for everything that you've done for us and the teams and for everything that you continue to do. We are forever grateful. And, um, we are blessed for this community and the love and the friends and family that we have found through Unpassive. Um, and we just appreciate you and everyone so much. Love you guys and appreciate you. Thanks for the time, Marty and Chris and Red. I can beat the Garmo because I'm not only a fan of your husband, I'm a fan of you as well. <laughs> nice try. <laughs> Too late, but nice try. <laughs> wow. There was some kissing going on there, Ash. <laughs> Yeah. Um, very good, Joyce. Thank you. Until Melbourne, I said, what's up? Anyway, I'm going to go to Angie Han. Angie, oh, I've been seeing Hi. you for so long. Anyway, go it's, ahead. It's so great to be there. Can you hear me? Uh, <laughs> not the perfect quality, but we can hear you. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, it's so, so great to be here. I, I think it's, it's been a year, I think. Yeah, maybe. So um, I wanted to add something. But you're glowing. Uh, as okay. long as you're happy, everything is fine in your life. So that's what matters. Yeah, again, everything yes. is fine, yeah. <laughs> if you need help, blink. I mean, we've been through that road before, so. I know. Yeah, that is one part of what I wanted to say. Um, <laughs> a big, big thing to the whole Unpacked family for being there for me in my darkest hour. Um, this loss meant a lot to me. I'm sorry. 
um, okay. Uh, I'm fine again. Um, and uh, yeah, okay. I don't want to go too much deep. Are you in so. Bangladesh or are you still in Germany? No, no, I'm in Germany. Oh, okay, just Bangladesh. want to make sure, yeah. No, not Changing energy, I, you know that, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, I would like to add something. Um, uh, in telling these times, uh, you can see who is really by your side. Yeah, when you love someone, you stand by his or her side no matter what storm comes up. Yeah, that is true love. Uh, uh, how I see it for myself. Um, and I know as uh, you're doing everything for us, for the world, and uh, you keep the messy stuff off of our backs. And um, that is uh, something very special. We uh, we just have to support you with our trust, with our belief, and that is nothing. Uh, for what you are going to try. So anyone who has ever built uh, anything big uh, or big company knows what goes, uh, what, what is um, going on in the background, good and bad stuff. Uh, we all want to make a difference in the world. We have a mission and that has given us an incredible, um, an incredibly strong bond. Uh, a bond of trust, of honesty, of strength, of yeah, love, of course, and that worldwide. And who can break that? No one. Yeah, we are here, and I hope Ash that this gives you the confidence, the strength, the faith, and the love to go through all the challenges and come out all the stronger. So thank you so much. Thank you so much. Angie, how old was your mom? My mom? No, my father died. But did, did your mom live with you too? Did my she... mom is still alive. Yes. Yeah. How old is she? Uh, 62. Okay, yes. I, I just wanted to know. She's, yeah. she's a baby. Forever 29, of course. <laughs> Nice to see you. Hi, Marty. Did you Garbo, you're fired. Yeah, I'll take over. <laughs> All right, muted, listen. Muted, these, muted. These three guys, I'll take. Marty, hold on. Just You're just too late. You're fired. Uh, there's these two guys have been waiting patiently. Uh, I'm going to call Oliver Charles Niraj, and I haven't heard from Jeffrey Morlock or Gershmender or Wasim Awar, so let's get it going, guys. We want to make Ash as late as we can for this next meeting so he can yell at me later. Uh, Oliver, go ahead, Oliver. Oliver, can you unmute yourself, buddy? Okay. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. Can you hear me? Mm -hmm. okay. Yes, um, we can hear you. Okay, I'm, uh, I'm sorry. I'm, uh, my network is, is plain. I'm, I'm in Africa, so the network is, here is not really good. Uh, but Mr. Ash, I just want to thank you. And uh, you are a brother to all of us on Pacifians and uh, the um, affiliate founders and uh, with the great job that you're doing. But I just want to make we the founders to understand that to build a complex, a complex technology with an advanced technology, it takes time. There must be challenges no matter what. And in our normal life, we face challenges. So what talking about building this kind of a complex technology, with the four, then we have the four pillars again that globally that he's building. So please, patience is a virtue. And for, um, I also like to beg all the prayer warriors to come out so that we should pray for Mr. Ash and the family for God to give him the wisdom and the power to carry on with the, with the challenges and we are going to be fine. There's no way we are fine and we are here to stay on pacifists Absolutely. here to stay and be positive, positive minds, to associate yourself with positive people, discuss positive things about unpassive, 
stop listening about the noise that is out there. We are going to make it. And Mr. Ash is the man to carry us like Moses carried the people to the promised land. Thank you. We are fine. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Oliver. Thank you. Uh, where'd Charles go? Charles, you want to say something? There we go. Yeah, of course. <laughs> are you kidding me? <laughs> All right. Can you guys hear me? Yes. Absolutely. Charles. Okay. Wow. But we can't see you. You can't see me? Are you serious? Uh, I see your I glasses. Need do, okay. I need to do something about that. Okay. <laughs> Can you see? <laughs> so, Welcome, wow, brother. How are you? Thank you. Thank you. It's a great day. You're looking great. Yes, absolutely. Thank you so much. I, I want to say hello to everybody, every founder out there. If you're connected or you're going to listen to this later, I just want to say hi. I want to say give yourself a pat on the back because it's been a great journey. We've all learned a lot. Uh, I don't want to repeat what everyone has said because they have said it all. I mean, I always like to attack Ombassy from the spiritual angle because I have seen so many revelations that I cannot say to anybody and nobody knows what I see. But I'm just going to say, guys, let's be patient. I know I should just ask Gladys a while ago, how come the bad guys are after you? But, but remember this. You are the chosen one because this is a divine project which has been predestined. There's nothing that anybody can or cannot do to stop it. Like you have always said, only God can stop it. Absolutely. Why, why would he stop something that he ordained? It's not going to happen, right? And so when he gives you this assignment, he's going to line up the people to be on your side. And we are those people, all of us, okay? We are those people that he has lined up. Even the people in the corporate, Mohammed Kamal, all those guys, he lined them up so that you can accomplish this project. And I just want you to realize or to understand that when he lines up the people, there are going to be some of those who will take us backwards, like those ones that just did recently. Right? And when they do that, it's because he wants you and us to learn from it and fail forward. Because remember, every time that happens, we'll learn and we'll get better. Right? So we have those folks that he has lined up to teach us a lesson and those that he has lined up to move us forward. But ultimately, we are going forward. Nobody, yes. nothing can stop us. So guys, patient endurance. Okay? Oliver just mentioned that we need to be patient. But I want to add this. We need to be patient and do something about it. Let's pray, like you said. So that's called patient endurance endurance. That is what is going to get us to our destiny sooner rather than later. And Ash, nobody could have been chosen better than you to do this job because like I said, I pray for you every day for the courage, okay? For the wisdom because I'm telling you guys what this man is taking, the kind of big things he's taking, I just wish that some of us would have been able to be there and take some of those beatings. But we thank God for your for your life. We thank God for your health. We thank God for your wisdom. And we trust in your leadership. Carry us forward. That's all I've got to say. Charles, that was amazing. Powerful, brother. Thank you. Yeah. Marty, I sent you uh, Niraj. And I missed Ron Hobart. So you got Niraj, uh, ba, 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 ba. Wasim, Gershmender, Ron, and Jeffrey Morlock. I think Jeffrey's the third in there. Take it, brother. That's everybody. Niraj, you're up. Thank you. Uh, first of all, hi, Ash, and hi, extended on passive family. Uh, nice to see everybody there to hear. Uh, First of all, there is a universal acid test uh, to know whether whether the company individual is growing or not. 
uh, it is said that when people start talking about you it is said that you are it definitely means that you are on the right path so don't worry about who is talking uh, and that is that is good uh, i would say that is good uh, you have to see that in a good thing uh, uh, another thing is we always talk about vision and there are three things uh, uh, like which i feel are very important in the vision number one it is has to be uh, re resilient resilient means that no political cultural uh, like irrespective of political or cultural your uh, it should not impact that and that's uh, i'm proud to say that on passive is going to uh, is doing that second it has to be inclusive it inclusive means any person who believes in thought process of on passive can be a part of on passive so exactly. it is inclusive it yes. is it is for neeraj it is for anybody uh, who who is interested in on passive and second the, at last it has to be service oriented it is not just about making profits it is about service to, and definitely uh, uh, like uh, we are serving humanity uh, we are going to impact humanity so the vision uh, i think uh, the vision is very clear and people are loving the vision and believe me ash uh, the whole of india is behind you uh, i'm uh, i'm not just saying for the sake of saying uh, i'm just uh, talking to you based on the webinars that we do uh, re, uh, and also the interaction with people so uh just enjoy uh, just enjoying the process and let's uh let's see what happens <laughs> thank you thank you so much neeraj always powerful and wise very good neeraj uh jeffrey morlock where are you at there you are look at that looking so polished and wise <laughs> Oh, God bless you, sir. Man alive. Thank you so very, very much. Marty, I appreciate you being here and all you leaders and everything. I'm honored to be here. You know, I just, wow. And and every time I thought of a good idea, somebody stole my thunder. Robin, I'm pointing like three fingers at you, girl. I love what you said there. But you know what? Uh, I, I want to just encourage everybody, you know, to to know that we are on the way. We haven't gone anywhere. We haven't really slowed down. Just because we don't see things happening from our perspective doesn't mean they're not happening, right? So we just need to demonstrate some patience and keep our expectations pretty real. You know, let's keep in mind that uh, our innovation and uh, our, our uh, development are uh, something that takes time. It doesn't happen overnight, won't happen in a month, but it's happening and it's still happening. It's been happening. And remember, if we can, let's think about the company's vision and objectives, lifting humanity. That's what we're all here for, right? To make sure that we're doing what's right because it's right. And we're celebrating every day. I see it on so many, so many webinars, talking to so many leaders and people and teammates and people that just send me messages. We're 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 celebrating every day. We haven't gone anywhere. Big big wins, small wins, right? Let's make sure that we share the updates that are given by leaders and by the uh, communities that are out there. And remember to 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 pivot or to shift, like like you do a lot, Mister Mufar, about adjusting your strategies. In, in line with what needs to be uh, done as things happen in, in real time, you know, uh, focus on doing something good every day. We brought that up before and let's not get bagged down. I, I like, you know, what Collins and uh, some of the other ones, Charles, you were saying about don't get bogged down on perceptions of delays or some of the, some of the garbage that's out there. It's going to be out there, right? And keep yourself in health, physically, mentally, keep it going, you know, encourage others around you, encourage your community, encourage the leaders. So I, I, I'm just, I'm glad to be here. Ash, I, I can't tell you how thankful I am so many times for the things that you have done and are doing, you. you know, and especially your family, your family's in the <laughs> thick of it, you know, putting the magic as much as they can. And, and I know they, they love and support you so <laughs> much and the founder base. And it's just an incredible thing that we're going through here. And I also want to just bring up again, as so many of you have, this is a journey that is all about success and winning and winning bigger together. And yeah, like some of you said, we're about to be in the best shape of our lives. So stay.
stick with it, stay on it, stay loyal, stay faithful, love your brother, love your neighbor, and love yourself. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. Hallelujah. <laughs> Good stuff, man. Well, Seam, go ahead, sir. Assalamualaikum. I said, how are you? Alaikum assalam. Good to see you, brother. Thank you, sir. Same to you. Uh, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Uh, uh, First of all, thank you very much. You invited me here for this uh, valuable webinar. It's honor. Uh, it's an honor to speak uh, here. So uh, I want to say on passive, as we all know, an innovative company founded in 2018 has constantly demonstrated its commitment to leveraging artificial intelligence to bridge uh, uh, the gap between the rich and the poor. Under the visionary leadership of Mr. Mufare on passive has embraced the slogan, we are here for the correction to corruption. Mr. Mufare is not uh, just a CEO. He is a kind and transparent man who, who prioritizes humanity and values over money. His commitment to these principles is evident in every aspect of company's operation. The company's achievement extends beyond software. X on passive boosts its own data center, its own internet, and it's incredited by ICANN. Additionally, the company is expanding into physical products, further demonstrating its comprehensive vision. Today, as we discuss the positive aspects of change within on passive, it's essential to recognize that change has been a constant and beneficial force since day one. Every decision, every adjustment has been made with our uh, best interest in mind. As Mr. Mufare recently uh, said, uh, he's now fully in charge, ensuring that the company remains on its promising path. On Passive remains steadfast in its goal to be the leading AI company without discrimination, dedicated to making a significant Im impact globally. Despite encountering negative reactions and unforeseen obstacles, On Passive has remained unwavering. Mr. Mufare's message underlined our pledge to deliver innovative solution and his assurance that we will be proud of what is being accomplished. This is powerful reminder that great achievements often come with their own set of trials, but our resolve and demonst uh, demonstration will lead us to success. As we move forward, embracing the changing and uh, restricting uh, needed to stabilize our message and optimize, uh, to optimize our operations, uh, we we ask for your continuous support and trust. The upcoming transformations are designed to make our platform more user-friendly and effective, and they are, they are beyond the re revolutionize your experience with OnePassive. In closing, I express my gratitude to each one of you, your unwavering support and belief in our vision and what drive us to keep pushing boundaries and achieving new heights. Together, we are building a beacon of hope for humanity and the future holds incredible promise. Thank you very much, sir. All right. Thank you Ron so Holbert. much, Wasim. Great job. <clears throat> Go ahead, Ron. Dan, you're on deck. Well, since I first uh, heard it on the passive in December of 2020, Having my background, of course, I checked out Mr. Akvara, and uh, I found that uh, after doing that, speaking with him for the first time, that uh, I felt in my heart that he was a honest and trustworthy individual. And uh, since that day, he has proved it many, many, many times over and over and over. Uh, as I trusted you then, I trust you now. And I'll trust you till I meet my maker. Hopefully that's a while from now. Thank you, man. But uh, I would hate to have to go through what you've been through since you started this company. Uh, it's amazing that you still come on camera with a smile. I don't know how you do it. But uh, just know that I know that everybody on this platform right now trusts you and loves you and can't wait this journey to uh, for this ship to start sailing, this big cruise ship. You know, they say the ocean of the sea is the largest cruise ship or something like that. But 
I don't believe it. I think it's the unpassive cruise ship that is going to be the largest ship in the ocean. And mm -hmm. uh, hopefully one day we can all be on it and uh, be standing side by side with you instead of uh, watching you on a screen. So uh, all I want to say mm -hmm. is thank you for we'll what you real us. big fat fish, not the one that That's Chris right. is fishing. That's right. Yeah. That's right. I want to thank you for uh, what sure. you've done and what you're doing. And uh, we look towards the future. God bless you. God bless you, brother. Thank you so much. It means a lot. And I heard that ass. I heard all that. All right, all right. Dan Street, what's happening? Are they fish or <laughs> fish samples? Those are. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead, Dan. Dan. Hurry. Hurry up, Dan. Hurry. I know. Hurry. You got, I'm the last <laughs> one. You got to go to a meeting. Yeah, I know. Well, I just remember hey, uh, a couple of weeks ago, Ash, when you said, uh, when you're trying to change the world, it's uh, it's not easy. It's not a piece of cake, and uh, I think we're finding some of that stuff out now. But uh, but I like to I like to focus a little bit more on the positives rather than the negatives. We know that the negatives, as you said, you've got solutions, and it's going to be fixed. So when you say that, I believe it, and I have all the trust and faith in the world in you. And uh, uh, you know, a lot of the things that intrigue me is when you said we're you know we're much closer than you think, and we can't get up, we can't get caught up in the details and things are going to be fixed. And when you talked about, oh gosh, a couple, a couple of webinars ago, when you were talking about the traffic and how it's changed and how I'm just blown away and I'm intrigued at how we're going to move forward with traffic. And when you were talking about how we have the AI and I, <clears throat> IT technology to make your life a joy educationally, financially, and in, and, in, and in sectors that we don't even know about yet. So opposition is everywhere. There's competition everywhere. There's always people that are going to try and bring you down, but you know, we love you. And uh, thank you for, uh, you know, one of the things you were talking about is the fact that uh, we have enormous support all over the globe. And I honestly believe that we still have enormous support all over the globe. And, and when we work together and stay positive, we'll get through it, and and we'll be proud of uh, the finished product. So, thanks again, and uh, uh, looking forward to the future. Thank you so much, Dan. And we believe also with the incredible comeback, uh, we're going to have uh, true, more clean support, and and it will multiply. I'm very confident about that. Beautiful. Thanks, Dan. And there we go. Ghost Render, you're on. Okay. <laughs> Can you hear me, Marty? <laughs> yes, indeed. How are you? Loud and clear. <laughs> yes, I'm, oh, we all I'm good. Yeah, I'm good, Ash. Hello, how are you? And hello, everyone. Yes, I was waiting for this moment to speak uh, patiently. And uh, uh, what a wonderful uh, speeches uh, uh, from everyone. And... Uh, Absolutely a great update by Ash. Uh, when Ash says something, he means something. And uh, as Michael was saying that uh, when we were here, we heard just uh, Mr. Ash voice. Uh, those uh, two, two voice messages way back in 2018 and we were right, right. here. Uh, right. So we believed in this. Uh, right. So believing is everything. Everything is believing this. Uh, this. Uh, a uh, particular single line sentence, I think, explains everything. If you have a belief in something, that's it. That's it. You don't need anything. You don't need any explanations. Nothing. Nothing in life. So that belief is here. And uh, I, I'm really surprised uh, right now. Uh, why? Because uh, uh, nobody's living here. Okay? <laughs> Founders all over the world. All over the world. And uh, I'm surprised that they are so positive. Uh, they often uh, message me. Uh, like a lot of founders from India uh, that uh, they all are uh, with Mr. Ash. Uh, uh, let it be, uh, it's taking time or some sort of negativity here and there. Uh, though they are cons they, they, they are some concerns, but they are not negative. This is one of the biggest things I think uh, On Passive has achieved that uh, irrespective of everything, people around On Passive, they are so positive and that encourages me a lot more. I think when daily, daily, uh, I see so many messages, uh, daily, some positive uh, comments on my YouTube videos. I think that is on passive. I think people are really loving this uh, company 
and the vision i think vision is greater than we all of us and this vision has created such a such a buzz in the market i think as mr ash has said that uh, okay uh, people are targeting it okay so what because we are in the market so people are going to target us so what but again the one thing which is driving on passive i think is the strong mindset of mr ash i think this mindset is driving everything and people are getting crazy let it be the, uh, our supporters let it be our haters uh, they are, are like thinking think of crazy what the heck is going on here right they are targeting us they are doing so much still people are here right on the other way if we see that lot of companies who who close their websites and uh, the ceo is nowhere people are nowhere but the opposite is here everybody is here everybody is so positive and everybody is i think getting stronger and stronger and this message i think uh, 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 is much more bigger than what uh, the haters are thinking of okay if they are listening all of us if they have listened to ash uh, i think this message message should go in market that yes we are here to stay and nobody can uh, shake us because all these 1.4 million people have a strong heads strong mindset mindset and that strong vision which is driving this on passive so we love you ash we love you on passive thank you very much nice one I, thank you Gersh. that was very good your voice is strong too and thank you and with you we grow and we stay strong too thank you absolutely ash. My last man. but not least the one and only ivy is in the house yeah thank you so much Thank you so much. Thank you so much, um, Mari. Thank you for the great 360 for inviting me. And I just want to say hello. 360? Three million, you mean? Okay. This, <laughs> yeah. this has been spinning. Yeah. <laughs> hello, Ash. Hello. Ash, Sister, Ash we you? love you. Thank you so I've, much. I've, I've been on, on fire. For, I've been on fire for you and a blazing for you and all of us. And like Gush just said, the support from everybody right. is igniting. You know, the way everybody, I I, I was so late and I was telling Mari, I said, Mari, uh, he has to go for a meeting. But yesterday I was thinking about you, Ash. I think about you every day anyway. But yesterday, you know what I was thinking? I said, he's been consistent. Anytime he comes, he says, I am Ash. Your friend, he says that. And... He, you add that word, and I am your friend. And I am your friend. Thank you for the friendship, Ash. People are I'm looking for family. friendship. You're stuck with me. <laughs> I'm your brother. Oh, my God. We just love you and thank you. And um, you have loved us. I have said the days of COVID when all the heads of states were running away and everybody was hiding, all of us. We were in our homes, you loved on us, you came to us, you gave us hope. For many hours, you cooked us well with love. So now when we return that love back to you, it's just a small love. You showed us so much love in those days. Those days you sit with us and you tell days. us. And then you tell us how much you're going to be doing. And then you added us, you said you'll take us with you. So at this time, we're not going to leave you because you first loved us. We just want to say thank you for that love and we return it back to you. And then we say thank you for being our friend. Thank you so much. And I meant, you know, miss those days for the meetings with us, not like the pandemic, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. Uh, we will do that again. Yeah, definitely. So absolutely the time to have your life changed uh, to the better, everyone. Uh, we are uh, on uh, the right track, absolutely. Uh, we're just making adjustments. We believe we're closer than you think, and I appreciate that. Today was incredible. I did not expect it, to be honest with you. I don't know if you planned it, but I was here to see uh, the trio, the usual. Ah, okay. And then there you are. Big crowd. I loved it. Thank you so much for everything you said. It was powerful. It's given me a booster, and um, you know we're we're gonna finish it. We we are gonna finish very very strong. Mm -hmm. Let's plan this again. It looks like we're uh, 
we have more to say. Marty, you're fired again. Well, I'm not fired. Take me off that spotlight. I don't want it on. He's, he's uh, refreshing his memory with Zoo. Yeah, I, I get it. <laughs> yeah. I had a crash course. Anyway, <laughs> thank you, everybody. This was amazing. It was a great, great um, webinar for sure. It, it inspired me, and I know it inspired a lot of people. So as uh, it was fantastic. But thank you very Let's much. Let's get it done. All right. Yeah, get, get it, it done. done. Yeah. Go fishing, Chris. I can't go fishing now, but uh, hey, Ash, I sent you a private message to uh, your thing from uh, Julie Pierre because she had to work today. But please don't send me any more messages, guys. My my fingers are bleeding right now. Ash, we love you, brother. Keep doing what you're doing. Thank you, thank you for all the beautiful messages and uh, we'll words you that in, you said. We'll see you in 2028, brother. Have a good one. <laughs> oh, beautiful. My goodness. Are you killing me? No. <laughs> all, right, all right. See you all. Thank you. See you at yeah. 7.30. Bye, everybody. <laughs> Bye, Ash.